Understanding the osteology of the scapula is crucial for comprehending its role in shoulder function and movement. Additionally, it provides a foundation for understanding clinical aspects such as fractures, dislocations, and surgical procedures involving the scapula and the surrounding structures. The scapula, commonly known as the shoulder blade, is a flat, triangular-shaped bone located in the upper back. It plays a crucial role in the movement and stability of the shoulder joint. Let's delve into the osteology of the scapula. Shape and surfaces. The scapula has three borders, superior, or superior, medial, or vertebral, and lateral, or axillary. It also has three angles, superior, inferior, and lateral. Processes and fossae. The spine of the scapula is a prominent ridge that divides the posterior surface into supraspinous and infraspinatus fossa. Above the spine is the supraspinous fossa, and below is the infraspinous fossa. The acromion process is an extension of the spine that articulates with the clavicle to form the acromioclavicular joint. The coracoid process is a beak-like projection located anteriorly and inferiorly to the glenoid cavity. Glenoid cavity The glenoid cavity is a shallow, pear-shaped depression on the lateral aspect of the scapula. It articulates with the head of the humerus, forming the glenohumeral joint, which is the main joint of the shoulder. Borders The superior border is the shortest and thinnest, while the lateral border is the thickest and extends from the glenoid cavity to the inferior angle. The medial, vertebral, border is the longest and closest to the spine. Muscle attachments the supraspinatus and infraspinatus muscles attach to the supraspinous and infraspinous fossae, respectively. The subscapularis muscle attaches to the subscapular fossa on the anterior surface. Various muscles, including the deltoid and trapezius, attach to the borders and processes. Blood supply The scapula receives its blood supply from branches of the subscapular artery which is a branch of the axillary artery. Nerves The scapula is innervated by branches of the brachial plexus, including the suprascapular nerve.